Unspeakable? 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 <laughs> What's up? You guys are probably like, uh, Unspeakable, what are you standing on, bro? Standing on glass, to be exact. To be 102% exact. But I do want to say that it's not just glass. You know, there's some slime blocks in there. Some other things. Uh, it's uh, more than just glass. Yeah. Yeah, this is going to be a pretty cool video. What's going on guys and welcome back to another video. So uh, I have finally got my pilot license surprisingly uh, not uh, I have finally gotten it and today we're gonna be checking out some massive planes now these planes are actually Working. Yeah, I know. I know I didn't build them myself, but oh Oh, I bought them. They're pretty expensive. But I do want to say that uh, this video is, you know, performed by professionals. Do not try this at home. Um, I mean, if you do try it at home, make sure you're, you're trying it on your Minecraft, you know? What am I saying? Okay. Anyways, but look at this plane. What? So this is a slime robotic plane that actually flies. Now, right now, it's just floating in midair. I don't really know how that's possible, but with Minecraft logic, it is. But once we turn on the plane, it's going to take off in the air and keep flying in the air. Yeah, so it never really touches the ground. It's just when the plane's off, it just floats. Doesn't really make much sense, but I mean, it's it's Minecraft, so you know. But this thing is so sick, and the amount of creation and hours that have gone into this is just insane. There's also apparently TNT launchers on this thing as well. I'm not really sure how those work. Um, it's definitely not these things. At first, I thought these were the TNT launchers, but those are actually kind of like the thrusters of the plane that make it go. So we're gonna have to find out where the TNT launchers are because apparently there's TNT launchers and I do have to load them with TNT. So we do need to figure that out. I was thinking it might be these dispensers, but if this was to shoot TNT, it would hit that. I don't know, maybe it like hits this and then bounces down. Why did I talk like that? All right, but let's go down here to the credits of the map. This is the guy that created it. I'm assuming this is his face. Oh my gosh, dude. Literally that face. That that's that's the face of success. That's the face you make after you built something like that. That's that's the successful face. All right, so let's read this. So, hey dudes, snoob or snob? Snob was here. I present to you the Minecraft Pocket Editions, possibly the coolest tech of August 2016. So yes, this map is a little bit old, but that's okay. That's okay. There's, you know, we can dust off. We can dust off the dust, you know? This is the slime block gunship cannons based on Sam Rad's design. Apparently it has a YouTube channel as well. And it says optional, put TNT in the dispensers. Don't forget to give credit. Uh, there are a total of nine TNT cannons, not missiles. TNT not set yet to avoid damage. Passengers should sit on the blue clay only. So we can indeed have passengers on this plane. Let's actually kind of see how many passengers we can have. I'm kind of curious. Okay, so you got two passengers up here. I mean, these are actually going to be the pilots. And then you got uh, two more. So that's four, six, eight, 10, 20, 30. Oh, I can do math. So it looks like you can hold about 10 passengers. Um, I don't know what happens if you try to stand on like different blocks, but honestly, let's try to fire this thing up. I have no idea how it works, but let's do it. Ignite here, use flint and steel, remove to fly, replace to stop. So do I just remove that and then maybe use a flint and steel? I'm not really sure. Guys, we're launching up the good old plane. Oh snap, is it going? Oh, that is so sick. That is so cool the way that works. Like just everything moves with it. Okay, so let's go. Let's go in the pilot uh, seats. All right, so I gotta stand on the clay. Okay, there we go. Is it gonna push me forward or is the clay just gonna? Okay, so it actually makes me stay with the clay. That's really cool. Um, uh -uh. ladies and gentlemen, this is your captain speaking. If you're looking out to the left uh, side of the plane, you will see absolutely nothing. Ladies and gentlemen, if you look to the right side of your plane, you will see another plane challenging us to a race. Now, we're not going to lose any races today. So, uh, yeah, strap your seatbelts in, have a safe flight, let's race. Uh, I think I'd make a pretty good pilot. You know, like I said, don't try this at home. But uh, this thing is seriously so sick. Like, let's take a look at this thing. I mean, it doesn't move as fast as you think a plane would. You know, it's not moving at... 400 500 miles per hour, but it's definitely moving. Oh Wait, did it stop? Oh, I just jinxed myself. Okay. Maybe it's not moving anymore. Maybe it's um Yeah, see when when the plane dies 
it just floats. Pretty cool technology, if you ask me. Uh, this is your captain speaking, ladies and gentlemen. If you look to your left side in front of you and your right side, you may notice that the plane has stopped. We are still floating. Our engines are all down, but we're just going to sit here and float. Um, so hold on to your suitcases and... Um, and um, yeah, we're just, yeah, have a safe flight, okay. I don't think the passengers would personally be very happy with me, but guys, this is the first plane now. Let me figure out how to do the TNT launchers, and then I have another plane that I wanna show you guys. So there's, yes, there's another plane, like this is one. This one's cool, but the other one, whoo, 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 whoo! All right, so we got a ton of TNT, and it says there's six different dispensers. Now, the only dispensers I see is there's there's one there, there's one there, and then there's one there. So those are three dispensers. That's just on one side of the plane, and then on the other side, you know, there's three more. So we're going to see, we're going to load up all these dispensers and see what they do. All right, so all the dispensers are loaded up. Let's see if we can fire up this bad boy again, and let's see if we can do this. So I believe it was right here, right? Yeah, I think it was. We light the flint and steel right here. It's just the signs are gone. So I'm not really... Oh, no. Oh, no. What did I do? Did I break something? Maybe the plane stopped because it actually broke. Is that is that why? I hope not. Does that do anything? Wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on. I think we got it. Oh, it's launching TNT. Yo, guys, it's dropping TNT. Check that out. Oh, it didn't go for very far, though. I feel like the plane stopped because it actually, like, broke or something. Here, let me try this again. Okay, there we go. Oh, wait, no, wait, hold on. I, I think I gotta remove the block. Uh, that's not doing anything. I think it's dead. I think the plane's, like, dead. Here, let me try the flint and steel again. Flint and steel one more time, please. Oh, no! What? Maybe we have to put the obsidian block back? I'm not really sure. I feel like we shouldn't because you can't really move obsidian around. So, like, oh, no, I don't know what block that was. Yeah, that's not good. That's not good. Um... Um, yeah, yeah, that's not good. Yeah, um, yeah, we're, uh, we're, uh, we're, we're doomed. Oh, we lost an engine. Look, <laughs> we literally lost an engine. This engine is just floating over here. Yeah, that's probably why it stopped working because we literally lost an engine. Okay, so we're going to go check out the second plane, guys. And I think we'll come back at the end of this video and we'll reload the map and then load up with TNT and see how crazy this thing is. But first, let's check out our second plane. <laughs> He's back again with the sight of success. So this is our second plane, the giant slime block plane. Probably one of the first MCPE planes. Slime block engine credits to derpy drums. Uh, follow the orange arrows, and then here's the map creator. So let's follow the orange arrows. And this is probably, like he said, one of the first slime block planes in Minecraft Pocket Edition. I think it actually is the first, if I am correct, but um, yeah, here it is. So it's not as big and fancy as the other one, but it is one of the first slime block planes ever. So it actually has seats in it, which is pretty cool. Uh, you know, that's where all the boats are. So you can have one, two, um, three, four, five passengers, I believe. Looks like you can, yeah, looks like you can have about five passengers in this plane. So not anywhere near to the other one. And this one doesn't have crazy TNT cannons or anything like that, but um, it is definitely a work of art and it's one of the first planes out there. My only question is how do you get the ore engines roaring? How do you get this thing started? I'm kind of looking around for maybe a sign, a hint of explanation. I need some help, please. I don't know what I'm doing, so uh, this might be bad. Oh wait, here it is right here. Okay, replace block with redstone block. Okay, so you replace this with redstone block and it says brace yourself. Oh my gosh, okay, this one moves a lot faster. Wow, that is cool. Okay, so there is our second plane. So definitely very interesting. Uh, I'm assuming it kind of works the same way as the other plane. It's just obviously a different size. It's a different type of plane. It's not as big, um, but you know, it kind of has the same characteristics, such as if one of the engines fail, just like that, you know, these planes are not very reliable. Um, it just stops and floats in the mid sky. When you pay a lot of money to get on a plane, um, you know, a plane like this is probably pretty expensive. And once you get on it, you're probably gonna go like five feet and then it's just gonna stop. Um, usually you can actually walk faster, which is surprisingly, but that's okay. That's okay. This is new technology. Don't worry about it. New technology, new things. We got to learn. We got to innovate. So, uh, yeah, that's the plan. Last stack of TNT and we are ready for takeoff. So the whole thing completely loaded with TNT. 
Uh, I also refreshed the map as well, so the plane won't be so broken. But let's go ahead and get into this. So we got to remove that to fly, and then we have to get a flint and steel. And then we need to ignite this. Oh, I can't reach it. Hold on, hold on. Go down, go down. There we go. Oh, snap. Here we go. Dropping TNT bombs like crazy. So you have to admit that this plane is definitely a lot better than the first one. Obviously, it's bigger. It's got TNT explosions. It's got double the passengers. It's double the size. But they're not very reliable. It's already stopped. I don't know if that's just because we lost another engine because uh, we did lose another engine. Uh, there's just an engine just floating. It's like, oh no, I lost my home. I don't know what to do. That is okay though, because we definitely have a lot more, um, you know, revisions to do this plane because uh, it is not ready for a uh, for, uh, flight. Yeah, this, this is, uh, it looks cool. Don't get me wrong, but oh no, when it comes to flight, no, 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 no. See, it's just gonna float midair forever. But guys, that is pretty much gonna do it for the slime planes. Definitely something really cool, and I figured I'd showcase these because we showcased slime robots in the past, and then I came across these, and I'm like, oh, this definitely one-ups the robots. Like, this is so cool. Like, it's literally a flying crazy machine, but guys, if you do like slime robots or redstone or anything like that, then leave a like on this video if you guys did enjoy it. And before you guys go, all I ask for you guys to do is click the subscribe button and click the little bell next to it, so you guys will be notified when I upload my new video tomorrow because I do upload videos every single day on this channel and you do not want to miss tomorrow's video because it is so, so sick, guys. But thank you all so much for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. Hope you guys have a safe and fantastic rest of your day, rest of your week, and rest of 2017. And I'll catch you guys tomorrow in a brand new Minecraft video. Woo!